metrics, the main important thing that you'll need to know how to do is um, write this into our format. So what is going to be squared here? What is variable is squared? Y squared. So automatically, I already know, just by looking at that, I know my parabola opens up left or right, correct? You guys can all agree with me on that. So I always like to kind of sketch my graph. I'm just going to do these little arrows. Because guys, just like you, I've taken tests, and I totally forget. I'll do something, I know what the answer is, but I'll totally forget. So just draw a little arrow. That's reminding me, hey, this parabola opens up left or right. Then I want to write this into my horizontal form. So I'm going to write this as y minus k squared equals 4p times x minus h. Now, I need to figure out what my h and k is, because that's my vertex. Oh, did I not write that in there? Sorry. If you see how the vertex is hk up there, the vertex is the same thing for this. So I'm going to write this into my form, y minus 0 squared equals negative 8 times x minus 0. So my vertex, which is hk, is 0, 0. Would everybody agree with me? Vertex is at 0, 0, hk. Just like we did before. Yes, question. Uh, the 4p, uh -huh. you don't mean the Not yet. Right now, we're just identifying what the vertex is. So, so you leave the four out and you just... Well, I'm saying, here's the general equation. This came from here. Yeah. All I did was just rewrite the equation. And then I rewrote this equation with my h and my k, which is 0 and 0. Okay? But yeah, we're about to get to the p here in a second. Yes? Yeah, look at it. Four is right there. So we need to figure out what p is. p is the distance from our, did you have a question? I have a feedback. OK. p is the distance from your vertex to your focus. So 4p is equal to negative 8. 4p is equal to negative 8. They're in the same position of our formulas. Let's figure out what p is. Divide by 4, divide by 4, p is equal to negative 2. OK, so the distance from my vertex to my focus is negative 2. However, it's 2. It's negative 2, though. So therefore, if my graph opens up left or right, if I'm going negative 2, should I be going to the right or should I be going to the left? Left. And you guys already know this because you guys already looked at the graph, right? On your calculator. You already know that it's negative 2. So my focus is negative 2, comma 0. And then the directrix is the opposite of p. What is the opposite of negative 2? 2. Positive 2. So we go to the right 2. Now, hold on a second. Here's your parabola you guys created. If my parabola opens up to the right, my, ver my directrix is a vertical line. Does everybody see that? So how do we write the equation of a vertical line? That's going to be x equals. Good. And then our parabola always opens up towards our focus, right? Opens up towards our focus. So quick scratch. Looks like that. Done.